It had been Christmas since late November. Joe, you'll remember that I was nervous but knowledgeable. I was talking to you about the bodies on the bottom of the blue and brown. We were watching the winter lights reflecting on Lorraine's mother. How did I get there? Well, I had swiped and swiped until it felt just right. And by that, I mean my hand and my heart were tired, so I retired into awkward act small talk with you because, well, you know, fuck it, you'll do. And I agreed to meet you for coffee and conversation on the South Bank. I'm not really sure why guys think the South Bank is a great place to go, but <laughs> who am I to question? It should be noted that I don't actually like coffee, but I'm very polite. <laughs> I began to wonder whether my body would join the circus of corpses. I don't know I'd mind the selfie that I'd mandated my mother to provide to the news because she has terrible taste when it comes to photos of me. <laughs> Being displayed in full view because, Joe, as lovely as I looked in the picture that I chose, being lovely and lost in the wayward ways of the Thames would be very inconvenient for me because, well, you know, I'd be dead. So I couldn't enjoy the attention. I mean, what's the point of being on the news when you can't actually like enjoy about it and post it on social media? I mean, <laughs> anyway, it should be noted that I really don't like being murdered. <laughs> Probably should have put that in my biography. What can I do? <laughs> I began to regret my mention of the many mischievous murders that began as beautiful moments because, I mean, what if he actually does it? What then? There were well-meaning lonely lights losing their spark in the darkness of drowning. And what if I was next? What if I would spend the rest of my life dancing with dolphins to the sound of sirens? Suddenly I was paranoid pondering about how the night would end for me, because, oh my god, what if he's a serial killer? And whether I had put the idea in your head in the first place, and whether everyone on the news would think I was a slut because I had too much cleavage in the picture I chose. <laughs> By the way, it should be noted that I don't like swimming, mainly because I can't. Um, so, I stared into the eye of the skyline, applying coat after coat of lip balm as your coat buttons gossiped with your hands about their plans for me. As it all turns out, you just hope to take me home, and to be honest with you, I would have preferred the murder instead. 